Hello there, viewers. How are you doing? Hopefully you're doing well. And I'm um, back at it at the actual advanced factory, I do believe it's called, is it? Yes, the advanced factory, getting rid of all the bin bags. You don't get much for them, to be honest, but you get a lot of them. So I should just get rid of them and I'll leave the boxes to actually compact. So that is better. I get about 10 boxes, then them 10 boxes become two boxes. So it's fine. But you can't do anything with the bin bags. They're just scattered everywhere. And today is a day that I finish off the house so jason is going to have a lovely house and i am going to have a lovely sized wallet with money in it that lovely moolah hello coming through don't know why you're just part there stop there yes i'm on the wrong side of the road there we go, this lovely trailer. Let's break card. Yeah, there we go. Works nicely. So, I need to finish building this house and then I can actually relax and continue with this Go Green adventure. Because that car is calling me. Spirit! Spirit! Come and get me! I will do. Don't you worry about that. Oh, I need you to come here. Send cargo. Thank you very much. Now, in the last episode, I did actually say you can actually change the time now. So, let's unpack you. Pop you there. Car's gone. So, my vehicle's not stopping it. So, E, you are not in the sleeping hours. Okay, when am I? Oh, is this dark at this time of night? I've got like two hours in game to go through till sleeping hours. Sleep, oh Carolina. Actually, speaking off topic, I've actually found this lovely nice drink. Mm. Toffee Apple Wonka Candy Can Sparkling Toffee Apple Drink. Zero sugar. But I wonder how I got the sugar out of the drink when... Apple has sugar in it. And like I said, can't see a darn thing at five o'clock, oh, six o'clock in the morning. Right, okay then. I reckon this is going to be as good as it gets. Seven o'clock. It's really bright. So, let's go ahead and get the exterior sorted out. Okay, if I put windows in and anything else, I want to get this exterior sorted out. There we go. Oh, come on, man. Seriously. This needs seriously fixing. All right, there you go. Down there. And there we go. Oh my goodness me. Single blimmin' clicking. Alright, pop that there. Get this out of the way. Now, there we go. Alright, so let's go straight up there. And then... 
Right, because the box is in the way, it stops it. Get that there. And... Not of the right amount. Okay, then. So, that's that box done. That's the door. Can actually put that in now. There we go. Voila. And voila. Right, there you go. Exterior door. And the rotate. Nope. There we go. That's in. Drill. There we go. Perfect. Is it me? Or is the game too quiet? I think it is, actually. Alright, I'm going to turn up the uh, sound. Be right, right, right back. Quiet. I just don't want it to be over my voice. But at the same time, I would like you to still hear the game. That's weird. I thought it was loud enough last time I checked. Well, hopefully the game isn't buggy because of the updates and the hot fixes. There we go. There you go. Heard that nicely. Inefficient amount. Okay, then. There and there. There we go. Another one down. Should have a box here already. There we go. Perfect. At least I can actually get this exterior cladding on. And then I can actually move on. Because I would like to do another house. And this time. I'm actually going to be showing a whole episode of planning stage. Because it's a multi-purpose game. Where you've got cleaning. Building. Destruction. Decorating. And uh, logistics for deliveries. And I'm only showing parts of them because I'm trying to lessen down the times of the actual episodes. But yet, I'm missing out a lot of the game. Because I'm doing that. So the next house that I'm going to build. I'm going to go ahead and do a whole episode. On designing it. Because people think it is just that easy to design a house to the standard you like. It's not. It's actually difficult. The game is difficult it does stuff which it shouldn't do but it does and it makes it difficult for you so what i'm going to actually do is do an episode of designing and then the next episode will be making it and then the other episode will be design, actually putting it together. First one's building it, as in putting the bricks in and getting all the uh, walls in. Basically, the last episode of that, basically this episode, kind of. Where I'm going to be painting and decorating and putting plaster in and everything else. Alright, let's go ahead. Get windows in. I actually wanted to actually put a tint on the windows to see how 
it actually works. And I'll tell you something. The tint is really bright. Really, really bright. Brighter than I actually imagined. So hopefully that doesn't affect the overall outcome of the building. I've got a oh, stop doing that, mate. Click. Oh my goodness me. I'm so fed up with this overlapping rubbish. It fits in nicely. There you go. And... Oh, I've actually... Oh, okay. Then I thought I actually kept the same colour for these windows. I think some windows have actually gone unnoticed and they're different colour to the rest. Right. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it's not all of them. Hey, skills. Lovely. It has to be the doors. Fuck oh, it's me. Some have actually come out as different colours. With it being the doors as well, I reckon, because I actually ordered the exact number I needed when I was styling one door. So, the game has spawned in two colours. Basically. So it wasn't me making a mistake. It is indeed the game. Well, here we go. I've actually placed all the doors. Fastened a few of them up. I only have to do the last few windows and doors. Like I said, I'm skipping a lot out of this episode. So I can actually have it in a nice bundle of time. This is a massive house. It's took a while to get here. And it's taken a while to actually uh, sort it out. Of course, I've shown you plenty of times me putting in windows and doors and fastening them, plastering, painting, doing everything and everything. There we go. Right, so that is that one, that one, that one. Four doors left. Go, that should be one, then three. I have to actually find them. So it was the front ones. It should actually tell you, you know, how each room 100% pastoring, 100% painted. It should tell you, right, I know how many doors there is for this room and windows. You've done it all for this room, 100%. So, you can ignore this room. Nope. You have to go hunting. Even though you thought you didn't have to go hunting. And done. Oh my Goodness me, that took a lot of time to actually do. Right, so, plaster. Let's go ahead and get this hallway done. There we go. Perfect. Right. And... I do believe the paint is any colour as well for this. Right, more plaster. Right, have you? Thank you. There we go. 
done any tiling. Okay. Let's go with you, 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 and you. And of course, you, 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 and you. There we go. Brilliant. Demolish you, pick you up, and check you out. Alright, so, shut you, shut you. I wonder. Yep, here we go. Right, I can't. Oh, it doesn't allow me to. That's weird. Okay, shut the door. Doesn't allow me to tile. Whoops. And then the stairs are underneath it. There we go. That's. I don't know what to think of. And why is this? What the heck's going on here? Oh, I swear this house is wonky as anything. Alright, paint. So I need... Where are you? White, grey, grey, grey. And... Oh, wow, look at this! <laughs> wow, oh my god. Goodness me, what the heck was that? I think I'm on three. Damn. Damn. That was like quick as anything. Can I get to the actual bit there to the left it's not going to let me is it all right pop you there so this is the living room man that painting what is going on that was amazingly quick all right go everywhere it's actually now got flooring on. Hallways are painted. And everywhere has got the borders on as well. And you know what? I'm not going to change the odd windows. They can stay as they are. So let's go ahead inside and finish off this whole entire house, shall we? So let's go painting in here is going to be a line and it is the living room. There we go. That's not bad. One squidge equals two walls. That is fantastic. There we go. Room done. And I'm going to keep the paints as well. So, over here we have got two colours. We have got gold, which is going to be for the kitchen here. And then, for the dining room, it is honey. Which I thought it would actually suit nicely. Alright, there we go. Perfect. Done. And done. There we go. So, in here, hallway, massive hallway leading to the other rooms. Of course, the stairs are there. So, in here is the office. I've gone just for simple colour really for the actual uh, office oh and I do apologize 
this episode has took multiple days and probably a week to complete because of me having a cold. So I might have started off well, but then eventually getting a cold where I couldn't actually record or do anything. So there's been gaps in actual recording and the dates of starting this recording and finishing. It's just crazy. All right, so that's the office done. Leading into the laundry where you put your washing machine and dryer and all that equipment. There we go. I've kind of gone for a bluey shade for all these three rooms here. So in here is the bathroom and it is bubblegum. I thought it was bubblegum blue, but no, it's bubblegum pink. So, whoopsie, I bought the paint, so I may as well use it. And then in here, it's cyan for the TV room. Yes, a TV room, which, don't get me wrong, I don't know if this is because of America, but normally what you have in a living room dash... front room that's in the UK is a TV and sofa and cabinets and it's you, one of your biggest rooms and it's mostly at the front of the house that's why it's always called the front room but people say living room and it's the biggest room and it's Awesome. Nicely, perfectly shaped out so you can have everything in it. And then next to it, if you're lucky, you'll have a dining room. And then you have a kitchen. If you're lucky. Sometimes you just don't have a dining room and your living room becomes a living room dash dining room. Nice hallway here. I haven't brought any... Oh, yes, I've brought colours up. Right, here we go. Children's room. I've gone for a nice purple. Violet, sorry. Here we go. Looks good. And then, next to it, it's a dressing room. Which is another thing which I find strange. Why do you need a dressing room when you can get dressed in your bedroom? Or the bathroom? I don't know. I just don't know. It's just strange. Right, here we go. That's the dressing room done. Going into a dressing room. Again. To actually go to our actual parents' bedroom. I could have done this placement much better, to be honest. But the planning was not allowing me to do it. And this is red. There we go. Perfect. You go there and you go there. Lovely jubbly. Right, so red. Can come down with me. Don't normally use uh, green often decorating. But it does come in nice shades, to be honest. Alright, there we go. That room's done. And voila. Hey, bouncy bouncy. And this bit, it's like the stairs, it blocks off the carpets. I've noticed this bit is blocking off the carpets. It's not actually going straight to the edge, as it normally would do once you've actually laid it. So I think once you've exited the game after laying carpet down or tiles and coming back in, it 
kind of stretches away from the edge in. I don't know why. And this is a uh, storeroom. So if you want to store anything here, you can do. It's right in the middle of the actual end of the hallway. That is it. 100%. There we go. So, I'm going to wait for uh, daytime to end the episode. But we're going to be coming back here to buy everything what this place needs. And then I'm going to sell it. Right, just saving a checkpoint. There we go. Because this game obviously does auto saving, as you can see. So, I would like to see how much I get for the next stage while well, finishing the house off as it is and that is actually quite a bit actually it's telling me straight away i don't have to click on finish or anything or is this the actual mission there's no auction so this is the actual mission so i'm not selling the house as i would sell a house if I bought the property and then built a house. Okay, so do I get more for thinning in the house with the items that it needs? That is what I'm going to check in the next episode. For this episode, it is done and dusted. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully this episode wasn't too bad or too long. But anyhow, remember, I appreciate you all. Even though I don't upload for a while, it's because I'm cold and I still appreciate you all. And you'll see me in the next one.